We gotta keep it. We gotta keep it from you. Oh, yeah, they look dope, man. A lot, though. That's my style, man. This is like straight Nike.com. Yeah. I don't even fuck with them. No, they're dope. What's up, bro? How you doing? Hey, you don't. Evan. Yeah. Hey, hey, nice to meet you. 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 He he had Elijah had an appointment this yeah, morning. Yeah. So I was like, let me go down there. Yeah. Get, in there <laughs> get a little sight, get a little, little marker. Yeah. 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 Uh, it's funny, my barber, because you know I like to keep it like bald. Like, yeah. Yeah. He won't he won't do it. Oh serious? And he's like, nah, man, this look better. <laughs> all right, all right. <laughs> That's dope. But I ain't gonna let the I'm not gonna get the period back. I'm gonna I'm gonna keep it low. Keep it low. Yeah. yeah. So people will see I have a jawline. <laughs> you know that's a that's a tactic. Having a beard is a tactic when you your neck and your jaw all merges together. <laughs> uh, what up? What up? It's your boy Michael C and my brother. What's good? See you, Brenda. It's been a long time. We've been doing uh social distancing and all that <laughs> shit. You know what I'm saying? But on some real shit, we still been getting it in. Uh, I got a whole setup at home and we're lucky to have access to gyms. Um, and we didn't want to like, I put some videos out, but it's not like I was trying to rub it in anybody's faces or mm -hmm. anything like that. Mm -hmm. But listen, a gym rat gonna find a way. Straight up, you know 100%. what I mean? But anyway, uh, man, me and Sam, we're gonna get it in with some, some old school fucking hardcore bench press, you know what I'm saying? Uh, volume is the name of the game. That's something that if y'all been watching me or Sim, y'all see that's what we do. Um, like I was playing earlier, you gotta go heavy. You gotta try to be strong. Listen, when you, when you develop a solid foundation, you're developing strength. When you're developing that, uh, that foundation, the look that you want is gonna be there. It, it's impossible for it not to, all right? So the reason that you gotta go heavy is because if you wanna get serious volume with heavy weight, you gotta go heavy and then come down Say you go to a one or three rep uh, max, you get to come down to something that's pretty heavy and still get 10 reps or more, you know what I'm saying? So you wanna do that as much as possible. So typically the flat, I'm there for a long time. That is uh, the primary uh, movement for the chest. But you will see as y'all start getting stronger, developing strength, when you're able to really fatigue your, your, your triceps doing the work, your triceps and your chest, you'll see, notice your, your lats start to take over. Your, your core start to engage. The bench press is a total body exercise, honestly, but you gotta be getting to that certain kind of weight and volume to be able to experience that. It's a fucking addicting thing, you know what I'm saying? But anyway, we're gonna get it in. Let's go. So we started out just very basic, very simple, 135. That's really a warm up. Um, that's easy peasy. I don't want y'all to do, just because it's light, doing 30, 40 reps. That's not what that's for. You're just warming up. Explosiveness is the name of the game. Our next is 225, okay? I want y'all to go up, uh, increase the weight, not a lot, but not a little. So I like to jump up by plates, but you gotta measure your own strength and be honest to where you're at. And uh, same thing, I think we, we hit maybe five reps right there. Mm. Sim got the reach of somebody 6'6". Six, six. <laughs> it's your way up here. This, this bench is not ideal because it's really low. So just taking it off is like a rep or a half rep. And that, y'all gotta be careful with that. Shoulder injuries on a bench press usually happens taking the weight off. It's such an awkward angle. So when they get heavy, I used to be one of those guys like, don't, I don't need no spot, none of that shit. I don't want nobody to lift it, but I let somebody lift it when it's heavy. Cause look how, look, look, at, look at this, it's like a rep. And then bringing it from here to there. Nah, ain't trying to hurt myself. But I sound like an old dude. I don't want to hurt myself. <laughs> I don't know if it's just me or do the weight feel heavier in here? <laughs> in CT gym, the weights feel heavier for some reason. <laughs> 
Uh. Touch and go. Easy. Out of all the lifts, bench press is the, the, the most difficult thing in perspective. Think about all the people we know you've trained with, right? Yeah. How, how rare it is for guys to get heavy weight on the bench, oh, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. It's because squat is more brute, str brute strength to get it up and willpower. Deadlift, brute strength to get that up. Because I, I don't have good deadlift techniques at all, and I can 635 any given day, you know what I'm saying? So, and, and my, with the worst form, you know what I mean? Bench press, you gotta be dialed in. It's hard, you know what I'm saying? I think that's why I love it, you know what I'm saying? And I don't ever want it to slip. Y'all watching, we're doing something very specific. We're not hitting many reps right now. We're trying to train intelligently and just touching, touching these heavier weights, just warming up the central nervous system before we start hitting reps. If we don't do it like that, we'll be too tired and too fatigued to get something heavy worthwhile. Same thing too. You want me to get a lift for you? All right. Let's get it. Easy. Hey. Okay. Got him. I'm going to go uh, see if I got wraps. Cool. That's what, that's, that's what I like to see. Smooth. I judged a, a good lift on uh, like a like a meat, like a powerlifting meat, and because uh, that's the standard, you know what I mean. So with a bench press at a meet, you gotta pause it and then press. And then there's another style called touch and go. There's competitions like that as well, which are easier because pausing it and then repping something heavy is hard. And it's not like a long pause. They just say one, and then you gotta go. But, uh, but it shows that you're not getting no momentum, none of that. So, but right now, all we're doing is firing up. We not, this is not a pile of the meat. We're doing bodybuilding. We're building our bodies right now. So we want to get maximum load. Because here's the thing, which I got to understand. It's, it's simple. To build muscle, some of the component, the gym components is this. Trauma to the muscle. The more trauma you cause to, to said muscle group, it grows back stronger. It's just the body's magnificent, just like a bone. If you break a bone, you know, if it's close to each other, it fuses right back together and it grows back stronger. Even if they reset it, it still grow back stronger. Why? Because your body's like, yo, in case that shit happen again, I'm gonna be more protected. The same thing with a muscle. We tear, we're literally tearing our muscle fibers apart right now. Um, but as we recover, it'll grow back stronger. But the more we tear it, the heavier weight we use to tear it, it grow back stronger to prepare for this kind of this kind of load. So when people be on that lightweight high rep shit like 225 forever, I'm like that's you gotta think about the quality of, of muscle you're gonna build. It's not gonna be there. You know what I mean? If you if you don't train like I've seen people who didn't train for like a, a month, like different people. You know what I'm saying? You know I've, I've had I've taken three months off of serious lifting, and I was still good, and my strength maintained when I went back to it. So, but we get, we get after it right. And my doctor was saying the other day, he was just tripping out, he's like, you know, he see these injuries all the time. He's, he's just like, people, their arms just get atrophied and skinny. Like, it's weird that you just, I said, nah, bro, I've been doing this. I've been lifting for so long. It ain't gonna leave me that, that fast. I'm gonna have some faith in me, doc. A lot of you guys tend to make your spotter work too hard, way too hard, or you have a spotter that's overzealous, you know, so you, you need to eliminate that big time, you know, there, there wasn't one set where we had to jump in, 
you know, like we, we know what we're working with, and obviously we were working hard. You saw us pushing, you know. So that's True. very important, guys, man, because I see it too often. It's not going to work, man. You're not going to benefit from it, and you're both like you're, you're slowing down your progress. Big time. Okay, okay, okay. So this is going to be our top set for today. 425. I haven't hit this in a, in a minute. I haven't hit this in a little while as well, man. Yeah. I haven't hit four since after since my surgery, so this will be. I'm yeah. <laughs> I, I've done 365 though. But um, and then the last two weeks I ain't went past 315. Some some days I just don't feel strong at all. Yeah. You know, I think I feel good today though. Churchill wanted to be Hitler. The UK Hitler. That was his whole thing. His thing was, they like, whoa, but he, he, beat, he beat Hitler. But read, read his, his doctrine, everything he's about. He wanted, he had his idea of a, mas a master race from the UK. You know what I'm saying? Hitler was just a German version. Lift. I'm not sure. All right. Now, now listen, on this one, if you, if you got two or three, go for it. This is the last set for heavy. I'm going to come with you just in case. Hey, come on. Let's get it. Come on. Easy. Get that shit up. Excellent. The motherfucker said mine. Mine. That's that Wakanda shit, baby. My profile is vivid uh, images of my living Which cultivated in prison Is he a young Machiavelli Thugging and not giving a fuck Cause you look hard but you don't want nothing nah. Nigga you frontin', you fallin', you stand for nothing yeah. I'm a baller fam, I'm stuntin' My rubber bands is bustin' It's the introduction, yeah. addiction These bitches love it, I'm wishing you niggas up Cause I'm hitting you with a dozen, with a dozen. Hollow heads yeah. Your head hollow, yeah. this the coop hop on the bike, cause them feds follow. Hit the block fresh, fresh. Air Force white tees, I'm a hot mess. mess. And you are not fresh. No. I'm the lock mess. Nah, I'm so cute, man. Shout out to my boy Jocko in Dakota. Good looking out. It's just what I need right now. Let's get it. More niggas in my clip hey. than the Wu Tang. We really move things. We got the city locked. Yeah. You know you feel to me. Cause this city's hot. Let's get it. All day. Come on. Yep. Ooh, come on. Ooh, come on. Four, zone out. Five, come on. Six, come on. Seven, come on. Eight, come on, son. Nine, come on, baby, you got it. Drive. Excellent. Three, <laughs> not 14. I saw the video the other day. I don't know if it was on stories, but I remember I was counting for ages. I was like, Jesus Christ, you were doing three plates. Oh, okay. When was it? What, what video was this? Was, was it with Big Boy? You were oh, wrecking, oh wrecking. 20, 20. We both hit 20 at the, yeah. at the gate. I was like, jeez. That was a, uh, yeah, that's my best on a, on a 315. It's But I got, I got 405 for nine. Nine reps? It was, yeah. but I, I could only do it when I touched five. Five yeah, yeah, come back down. It's just easy. Yeah, it just of course. feels so much lighter. Yeah. It's a cheat. It's a hack. I don't think I've ever got, I've, the most I've ever gotten four plates is about four or five reps years back. So All right, wow. we're going to get you this fucking sand. <laughs> I'm telling you, bro. That shit could be done, bro. You no, okay. uh, I don't know about 10, but I could definitely get some 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 reps with, with five, four. bro. You, you halfway there. We got to get you 475. And then you could do four, four or five. Because, I don't know. I think, if I'm not mistaken, because back then I used to do too many reps going up. Mm. 
what I'm saying? I'm sure you did the same thing. I did the same, yeah, yeah. So I probably, if I was doing it like this, I probably could have gotten more. Yeah. But I'm substantially weaker than right now than then. Okay. Because I was hitting five plates. Of course, you know yeah, 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 yeah. So yeah. I say one more yeah. at 315. Yeah. Get it. Uh. 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 Now rap. Get some reps. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Woo. That shit rough. Pause reps. Not for the faint of hearts. Yo, this kind of training, it cuts through the bullshit. Yeah, you, can't, you can't bullshit yourself with this. Pause reps, it, 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 it separates the men for the boys. You know what I'm saying? And what you saw him, him just do, pause, that's burning you all the way out. And then to get reps after that, that's, that's fucking gangster. That's good work. Like, it's always good to friggin' have a nice finisher at the end. So obviously we've done lots of volume. We've gone heavy. We've incorporated everything. We've done some strength training there. We've done the reps so we get, we've done reps with heavy weight so we get mass. That's how you build muscle. But then it's good to always finish off, burn out, use whatever you got left. So that's why I did the pause reps and then the quick burnout. It's perfect. You can do drop sets as well. That's another way to like finish a, a, great, a great set. You know, just go right through the range. You know, but either way, always have a nice finisher. Indeed. All right, I do five. It was five. You did five, right? Yeah. Five pauses. I'll come up on your command. Do you want to lift off? Or? Yeah, I need to lift. One, two. Okay. Yep. 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 Wrap out. Yes, come on. Come oh, on. Fuck. <laughs> it's crazy because mentally you like, I'm a, I got this. <laughs> but your body like, calm the fuck down. You ain't got nothing. <laughs> Woo. That's effective though. But here's the thing. If I was to hit like 10 reps, I ain't done. I got to do more shit. So that's what you want. You want to be barely squeezing out a couple reps at the end. That way you know you got some, some good money. If you hit, if me or him hit 10 reps after the pauses, we still got more work to do. I'm not moving on. I'm not moving on from an exercise, a primary exercise, until I'm pretty taxed. Y'all got to do the same thing. Even if we're prescribing a particular workout for you, we both do online uh, training. I don't care. If I say do X, Y, Z, if you're not there yet with Z, keep, do Z.2, Z.3 until you're there. Or if it's too much for you, you can scale back. You gotta, it's instinctual. When we are giving you guys these workouts online or whatever, on these videos, it's a guideline, okay? We're giving you a foundation and a guideline, but you might be a little bit stronger than that, or not as strong, so you can scale it accordingly. The principles are the same and you can apply them, so. Exactly. But listen, so we're gonna be doing a lot of, a lot of different techniques and tactics. There's a lot that I did when I was, uh, when I went into a powerlifting meet, building up to get to a 500 pound bench press. I wanna get back there. I'm not there, I'm far from it right now. Um, Sim wants to get up there too. We both want to get these big numbers. Human body fluids are so disgusting to me. You ever pick up somebody's shaker cup by accident? No. Like, I remember one time, who was in Miami? Yeah. Pick up my cup, it looked like somebody else's cup. And you drank it. And I knew because it was warm. <laughs> my shit was cold. Fuck up my dad. Fuck yeah. up my Fuck up my dad. I've done similar, exactly. It wasn't a shaking cup, it was, it was like a juice. Uh -huh. And like, you know when, a, when, a, when a, a gym pretty much sells the same juice? Yeah. So everyone, the same color. Yeah, the same. Yeah. And I drank it, I was like, this ain't right, like, this ain't right. And then when I realized it wasn't mine, I was pissed. I don't know who, who, who drank this, who, who's this? Yeah. <laughs> We're deep in this. Y'all been seeing us for years and we still got goals and, 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 and lamp uh, benchmarks we're trying to achieve. Y'all can have the same thing, you know? Um, 
sometimes people feel like they got to be in some kind of competition to work out. Like, I don't have no motivation. There's no competition, man. Look, the only competition is, is, is your own. Like Mike said, write your shit down. Know what you're working with. Know, know what your lifts are so that you can set your own goals, you know? There's, there's no competition here between me and Mike. Uh, my, if, if you want to know, Mike's stronger on bench press. <laughs> that, that's it. Barely. <laughs> Barely. But, but there's no competition. I, it's, 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 um, it's just pushing each other. Like, he, he, he knows what I can do. So he won't let me slack and I won't let him slack. Right. You know, regardless of whether our numbers are the same, I'm not gonna, we're not going to let each other slack right. on what we know we're capable of. So right. that's, that's, that's one thing. And you guys, same, don't slack, you know, and don't feel that you have to either copy us as well. You don't have to do the same way if that's not in your... In your, in your if it don't work for you, work for yeah, you, tr you could try it, but if it don't work, there's a lot of different programs that I tried that like, uh, and I'm going to be honest with y'all, I've tried, I'm not going to name the pro programs and protocols that I've done. I've done a lot. And none of them, they felt like it was too easy. I would have to finish doing my normal shit afterwards. So I, for me, I know how to get there. You know what I mean? So we're going to be giving y'all, if y'all down, if y'all want to see it, we're going to be giving y'all a lot of tactics. It's a lot of different techniques to build strength on a bench press. Um, me and Sim both dedicated to get that heavier weight. So if y'all want to see it, y'all got to subscribe my channel, Simeon's channel, and just keep checking in. And we'll just keep hitting y'all with that fire, fire, fire. And we out.